Hey everybody, my name is Mike Liu and I'm the director of A Good Man Is Hard To Be. So this project is a short film that's inspired by Flannery O'Connor's short story, A Good Man Is Hard To Find. If you don't know it, it's a brilliant short story that she wrote back in 1953 about a family traveling from Georgia to Florida on vacation and the trouble that falls upon them when their car flips over in the middle of the road leaving them stranded. While this story, written by the talented Samantha Gessner and myself, isn't a direct adaptation of O'Connor's story, it takes a lot of inspiration from her characters, the setting, the themes, and the tone. And that's something that I'm really excited about. I think O'Connor's Southern Gothic style is very unique, and not something that you see often in media. Bringing that into this film will create a very interesting experience. The film takes a look at Sammy and his family. They own a homely little restaurant in the countryside and live perfectly peaceful lives. That is, until one day when a group of misfits step into the restaurant. And through their encounter, we see how people act and change in stressful situations, and how a person's true colors can be revealed when their lives are on the line. Over the past few years, I've made several different shorts and projects, and I've learned so much from each one of them. And I'm excited to bring that all together now for this film. I'm also very fortunate to have such a talented group of people working on it, both in our cast and crew. I can't wait to see what Ian Hussey, our cinematographer, brings to the screen. Our cast is made up of many fantastic actors. Tim Hooper and Mika Fitzgerald as our two leads. Christiane Amorosia. Bradley Bundley and many others. For the past few weeks, we've been prepping the film for production. We've got the perfect location, this diner set, ready for the film. Everything is coming together now, but up to this point, all that's been done has been possible only due to people giving their time and volunteering their efforts. Moving forward into production, however, we want to raise the bar and make the film as high quality as it can be. And that requires some funding, but that's where Indiegogo comes in. There are certain elements that this film needs to not only succeed, but be the best that it can be. While we have the location itself, there's still more needed to really get the time period and setting across. Set dressing, props, costumes and wardrobe, makeup, this all needs to look and feel authentic. We're going to be shooting on a weekend in July, so it's going to be two packed full days, and we want our crew to have the equipment they need to work efficiently, safely, without sacrificing any quality. And so we need the help of anyone who comes across this page. Friends and family, people who know us, people who don't know us, fans of O'Connor's original story, and people who've never heard of it. Any amount of support goes a long way towards us reaching our goal. And so we humbly ask for you to consider backing this project. You can check out our campaign page to see the different perks we have. Whatever you're able to do, it would mean the world to us. Thank you so much for your time.